From old false teeth and moldy soup, Gerald and Jean made a gloop, and when that gloop with slime was laced, out came a free bag monkey face! Fritsuka's malfunctioning again! Oh no, it's one of our best gizmos! It's powering up. Good intake of flea bag wind and the Fritsuka will be... <laughs> Have you seen it? There's a, there's a mingle pet on the loose! A mingle pet? One of those new super cute uber fluffy pets? You got it, Gerald. It's a kitty hamster! It's uber fluffy and it's all over the place! Ah! 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 Give us our precious kitty hamster back. Mingle pets are far too fluffy for you. Oh, wouldn't it be great if Gross Out TV could have its very own Gross Out Mingle Pet? Yeah, like a cross between a, a, a slug and a chicken. <laughs> or a worm and a skunk. Ah, uh, Mingle Pet. Please, Gwendolina, tell me a little more about your latest fluffy sensation. It's like this, Spammy. My chain of fluffy pet stores was struggling, so then I came up with this idea. Why not combine two fluffy pets for double the fluff? <laughs> and ten times the profit. Guinea chicks, puppy bunnies, koala ponies, there's something for everyone. Oh, brilliant. Quite brilliant. And such a simple machine. The molecule mingle is child's play. I can set this dial to do any animal I want. How about a turtle? Now all I need is a, a live subject, and I can mingle them. <laughs> Cheesy bread platter for two. Oh, uh, super. I'll just place it on the table and kindly step under the laser. You want me to step under a laser? Oh, go on. All you'll feel is a little tickle. Hey, 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 this is weirding me out. Make it stop. Oh, 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 ha, oh, oh. <laughs> Truly remarkable. Hmm, so those kids want a gross-out mingle pet. It's the perfect bait. Me feels an evil plot coming on. Combine your molecule mingler with my mind control device and... <laughs> Excuse me. Hello? Hello? Anyone home? The finest collection of gross-out mingle pets ever assembled. <laughs> Not much of a grand opening. Hello? Just coming. Time to adopt the persona of Labrador Clack, Pet Shop Owner Supreme, and Deathbeak. Listen out for my signal. Uh, you must be gross out TV. Welcome to Labrador Clark's Pet Shop of Doom. Now, gentlemen, feel free to film as I conduct the guided tour. Fleabag, in position, please. We are about to, we are about to, will you? We're about to witness the grossest pets ever. Prepare your eyeballs for the Hippopoto Pig. This drooling creature needs to have his chin wiped with a mop. And here we have the rhinocerfrog. This beast needs to go to the bathroom 45 times a day. Fantastic! <laughs> and what's up this corridor? My finest and grossest pet. Oh, is that the phone? I said, is that the phone? Excuse me, gentlemen. Just carry on up there. I'll be right behind you. Those gross mingle pets are awesome! I can't wait to see what's through here! This is no pet shop. This is a... A trap! Time to meet the molecule mingler. Gwendolina, combine the monkey creature with some other form of repulsive wildlife. I 
never thought something so gross could be such fun. <laughs> this is kind of weird. Oh, Mommy, look at the funny monkey fed. Fleabag! What have you done to Fleabag? This is really evil, Spamflex. Why, thank you. I feel like I have a lot of gas. <laughs> have you no class? Now we're all going on a little journey to the Spamflex Copter! So, let's get this straight, Spammy. We lower the hideous monkey elephant from super high altitude right into the center of the school. But why there? Well, because, my dear, this isn't any old school. This is the Snooty Academy for gifted and overprivileged children. And the man who can get me back on television... Studio boss, Frank the Fourth Forthmeyer. ...is there to see his nephew Franklin at prize-giving. I see. The creature creates mayhem. Yes, thanks to this devilishly devious mind control gizmo. Gross out TV are humiliated. You get your TV show back. Oh, deep joy celebration, yay! Then your supersized puppy bunny enters the fray, defeats the monkey fant, and you get a supersized dose of publicity for Mingle Pets. Win, 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 win! I love it! <laughs> <laughs> Bag. It's bad enough in here without any of your monkey vet farts. <laughs> oh. oh, sorry, Gerald. I just can't help it. Hey, we're landing. <gasps> I'm getting the fear. <laughs> the fear, I tell you. Flea bag, hold still. What could be so bad? Where are we, guys? The smugly school. The snooty academy for gifted and overprivileged children. Time to take mind control of the monkey vent. Deathbeak, open container doors. What kind of abominable creature is this? <laughs> ah, Fleabag, you've turned into some sort of monster. How dare you bust into this exclusive establishment? My nephew Franklin is beyond upset. Gross out TV is over, and you, you should be sent to a zoo. Tut, tut, tut. Look at this, most unfortunate. I'm a long-term admirer of the Snooty Academy. I was in the area and couldn't resist attending the prize giving. Well, your timing is impeccable, Spamflex. Gross out TV is fired, and I want your old show, Yucky Science, back on TV. Wondrous news. Ah, let's find a quiet spot to sign a contract. Ah, how about the school canteen? Ah. We don't have a canteen here. Uh, we'll go to the Academy's five-star Cordon Bleu a la carte restaurant. Oh, of course. And you'll be pleased to hear that I will bring an end to this mayhem. <laughs> Deathbeak, give Gwendolina the signal. Enter the giant puppy bunny! Now seek and destroy the nasty monkey fans. We gotta bust out of here and help Fleabag! What do you got in your back? The fartzooka! Glass eyeball! Whoa, back up there. You brought the fartzooka? Yeah, but it's totally underpowered. <laughs> Not if we top it up with Fleabag's monkey fan gas! You're brilliant! Here goes! Way to go! <laughs> Fleabag's being overwhelmed by fluffiness. We've got to fight back. How did you ninnies escape? <laughs> Whatever. You're doomed anyway. He's under mind control. <laughs> Gerald, use the fartzooka! Uh, uh, hey, what's going on? <laughs> Fleabag, you're back! Oh, fart that puppy bunny into oblivion. <laughs> Now, to track down Spamflex! Ah, a mere elegant squiggle away from immortality. My old show back on TV. What? 
stop! Time to explain to Mr. Forsmeyer how you used the Molecule Mingler and transformed Fleabag! What are they talking about, Spamflex? Were you behind all this? I really wouldn't know what you're talking about. Uh, who are you going to believe, Frankie, me, or that brute? Stop right there! Spamflex, my Mingle pets are over, and it's all because of you! It's Mingle time! No! I want my team show back! Ah! Gross Out TV is back on television! Ha 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 ha!